Good evening, everyone. Metabolic and nutritional diseases in sheep and goat. So here I have concentrated only regarding the clinical management and purely regarding the practical aspect. How to diagnose a case clinically and how to treat the case. Hypovitaminosis. So here we have to differentiate from the other conditions. So here hypovitaminosis is the day old kid. Same thing in the calf also. The day old kid. It is unable to stand. So after kidding or lambing, the kid is unable to stand. It will be always in the recommend. When you make the animal stand, see the head is, uh, some animals they will be having hydrocephalus like thing and uh, staggering gait. When you make the animal stand, it will be having staggering gait. It will be, there. It, will be it cannot be able to stand properly. And the classical sign is the uh, rotation of the head. The animal will be rotating the head like this. The animal will be rotating the head as a 360 degree angle like this. Rotation of the gut will be that. That is due to the increase in the intracranial pressure. Increase in the intracranial pressure and the animal cannot be able to maintain the posture and it will have a typical rotation of the gut. That too in the day old animal. Ataxia. Ataxia means when you make the animal um, standing posture, it won't stand and suddenly it will fall down. Ataxia. Okay. These are all the classical clinical signs and you can treat this type of cases very well with the vitamin A. Injections can be given for 40 units per kg body weight intramuscular for 5 days or till recovery. A very good dramatic response will be noticed, and you can see this case. This is after the treatment, and this is before treatment. And uh, the farmers they will say they will bring the animal with the history that first one week it is normal, it is walking normally, drinking milk, everything. After one week or ten days, suddenly it becomes uh, recumbent, and the nervous signs are. Uh, and notice me that is polio encephalomalacia. That is a separate entity. Hypovitaminosis A means from the day world itself, the animal is not able to walk, not able to stand, and the rotation of the head will be there. This is hypovitaminosis. That's why that is how we have to differentiate. So, hypovitaminosis A, you have to give only vitamin A that will recover. First few days or first one week, 10 days, the animal is normal. After only it is exhibiting nervous signs. It is a clear case of B1 deficiency. You supplement time in, the animal become normal within two or three days. This is the after treatment. The animal is able to walk normally. 